Hello, welcome to SharePoint Journey. This is Devendra Veligandla. In this lesson, you will learn how to create Manage Navigation in SharePoint 2013 online. To enable Manage Navigation, just open your SharePoint site. Go to Site Settings. Under Site Administration, click on Term Store Management. In the term store management, select the taxonomy and create a new group. Here I'm going to name this one as global navigation. And once you create a new group, click on expand this, create a new term set. I'm going to name this one also global navigation. Once you create the global navigation, click on indented use and check use this term set for site navigation click on save and let's go ahead and add a new term called home for this home go to navigation option and select simple link or header and click on browse here just click insert and click on save to save the changes so once it is done go back to the site settings and click on navigation here if you don't see navigation option under look and fail you have to activate publishing feature so to do that go to site collection features and activate SharePoint server publishing in Rancher feature so in our case it's already activated so let's go back to site settings and navigation here you can have global navigation as well as the current navigation the global navigation is the one which is showing on the top and current navigation which is showing in the left bar so I'm going to change only the global navigation to use manage navigation so just select the manage navigation and here for the manage navigation we have to choose the term set now here you could see that the global navigation which we have created is available so let's go ahead and select global navigation and click ok now if I go back to the site um, we could see that a home option is available so if you click on this it will again redirect to the, the same site because we have given to the training okay so I hope this help you to configure a managed navigation in SharePoint 2013 online thank you for watching this video we'll see you in next lesson